Hi, I'm Phil Walton, creator of the Potato Lens featured in the viral Potato Boss news story. This is a quick video to show you how to get snap camera set up so you can be a potato, jellyfish, pickle, or pretty much anything you want to share a little fun in your next video conferencing session. Let's get started. First, go to snapcamera.snapchat.com and download the snap camera software. Next, make sure any software or program that's using your video camera is disabled, then install the software. When you open Snap Camera, you can immediately begin playing with any of the lenses and effects that you see in the tray below, or search for them in the search bar. To trigger a lens, just click on it and you'll immediately see it in action. To turn it off, all you have to do is just click on it again. Once you've found your favorite lenses, you can click this little star and favorite them. All your favorite lenses will appear in this menu on the side. You can even set up hotkeys. To host a meeting with Zoom, go to zoom.us and say host a meeting with video on and it will have you create an account with them. It will install the Zoom software to your desktop. With the Snap Camera software already running, open the Zoom software and click on new meeting. Your video window will pop up. Next to this video tab, make sure that Snap Camera is selected. Then all you need to do is invite guests and have your meeting. To use Snap Camera with Google Meet, go to meet.google.com, then sign in with your Google account. Make sure the Snap Camera program is open and running. Select Join or Start Meeting, type in the name of your meeting, and that will give you the preview window of your video. Select these three dots for more options and go under settings. Select video and make sure that the camera is set to snap camera. Then say done. Now you're ready to start your meeting. To use snap camera with Skype, go to skype.com and download the software. Once it's installed and you've signed up for an account, then make sure that snap camera is open and enabled. With Skype open, go to Settings, Audio and Video, and make sure that Snap Camera is selected as your primary camera input. Now you're ready to hit Meet Now and start your meeting. You can also adjust your camera input here by selecting this drop-down option and selecting Snap Camera. Now your Snap Camera effect will be enabled on your call. To use Snap Camera with Microsoft Teams, go to teams.microsoft.com and download the desktop software. You'll also need to sign up for a business account. With the desktop software open, make sure you have Snap Camera open and running first, then select this icon to start a video meeting. You can add a subject and say, Meet Now. To make sure that you have Snap Camera enabled, go under More Actions, Show Device Settings, and under camera, make sure it says snap camera. That's it. Now you can enable fun effects during your Microsoft Teams meeting. Now when you use Zoom, YouTube, Google Meet, or Microsoft Teams, you can quickly have access to any lenses that you've selected. You can also use snap camera with Discord, and there's even a Twitch extension. Just make sure Snap Camera is open and your camera input is switched over to it in the settings and you'll be good to go. It's as easy as that. Have fun at your next meeting and keep those viral moments coming. Thanks guys, we'll see you later.